Now, let's demonstrate the optimal workflow using the Kodak Custom ICC Profile. In this example, we're using Adobe Photoshop CS. For other Photoshop versions, refer to the appropriate workflow document you downloaded earlier. Remember, at any time you can press pause to check screens or to catch up. Once you've optimized your image in Photoshop, select Print with Preview from the File pull-down menu to properly apply the custom profile. Click Show More Options. Ensure the Color Management drop-down is selected. Then choose the Kodak Profile in the Print Space Profile field. Within the Profile pull-down, select the Paper Profile labeled KPro IJ Paper for your printer. Also verify Perceptual is selected in the Intent field. Make sure the Black Point Compensation box is not checked. Now select Page Setup and choose the appropriate options for page size and orientation. When finished, click OK. Click Print and choose the printer you want to use. Now select Properties. When you downloaded the profile from our website, we included a short PDF file which illustrates the exact settings required for your printer. In this demonstration, the printer we've selected requires that you set paper type to premium luster photo paper. In the advanced settings screen, we need to select photo 1440 DPI and verify high speed is turned off. Now for the most important setting, color management. The printer's color management must be turned off. In this example, we've selected ICM, and under the ICC profile, select No Color Adjustment. Once everything is set correctly, you can save your settings for the driver and name them. This will enable you to easily return to the right printer settings for Kodak Professional Inkjet Photo Paper. Your driver settings are now complete. Click OK to start printing. Next time you want to print, just use Print with Preview and click the Print button. It's a good practice to verify that the settings haven't changed during the computer startup.